What's up everybody? So today I'm going to show you what I found when I changed the battery out in our 2019 Pilot Elite. Um, coming from the car audio world, what I found is just, it's sad. It's sad and pitiful. This, this small wire here, this is just sheathing. So the wire is actually this big. It is a four gauge wire. This is the ground for the entire vehicle. That's, uh, that's really, that's not acceptable in my opinion. So what I did, let me start, pop this off. You come to this side, you pop this side, you just pull up, you come back here, pull up, pull it out from under that. So then you take your screwdriver, twist these out. miniature electric screwdriver there. Electric, what am I thinking? My electrical screwdriver. Pop that up. I take these. Pull these out. <clears throat> and this, you just take, and you kind of pull it up and out of there. Set it off to the side. So now I'm not gonna pull this apart right now, but um, as you see, this originally, came from here to here. Okay, well, factory Honda, as you see, I've, I've scuffed it up. This was a painted surface. The main ground of the vehicle was on a painted surface. It was not scuffed, it was nothing. The ground was through the bolt. So what I've done is added a one gauge Sky High Car Audio oxygen-free copper um, ground from here to here. And then I've added a four gauge copper ground over here to the top of the throttle body back there um that just it, it's good to have a ground on the throttle body considering it's mounted to a plastic intake i've uh, learned that in the performance world of other vehicles and then um i went ahead and added down here you can see a third one gauge ground wire that comes across through here. It's all zip tied nice and bolted right to the cylinder head right there with a nice shiny bolt and everything's cleaned up. Everything's heat shrinked with uh, triple wall glue sealing heat shrink. Um, the first thing off the bat that I noticed was the charging. I gained about half a volt of charging voltage just upgrading this ground. Um, highly recommended. I'm curious to see if I'm going to have any of the electrical issues the infotainment system seems to have with this one. I haven't yet. Um, I have had it where, you know, the car play freezes and you have to pull the fuse, but I haven't had any noises or cracking and popping. As far as installing the excess battery, I had to cut the box all the way around, all the way across, over here, and then across the front. There's a fan down here. I actually have a piece of foam that goes right there I need to install today. To seal this off but this battery is just a little bit bigger but it gives you about 15 more amp hours and it, it's honestly just a much better battery than the honda one so my next upgrade is going to be this tiny wire here this little uh, that almost looks like a four gauge that is going to go from the alternator to the battery for charging i'm going to go ahead and upgrade that to a one gauge like this um, even without the added accessories, I think the car needs it personally. It, it has a lot of accessories from the factory. But yeah, that's um, that's it. It's pretty simple, pretty straightforward. I'm uh, thinking about maybe selling some of these, um, putting them together. If anybody was interested, uh, I'll, I'll I'll keep it. I'll keep everybody updated in the comments. I I recommend it. I I think anybody with a 2016 to 2019, 2020 at this point pilot should uh, definitely consider an upgrade in their grounds. Thanks for watching everybody.